दिस क्वेश्चन गिवन इन गेट 2015 सेशन थ्री ई सी पेपर द क्वेश्चन इज इन द सर्क्यूट शोन डायोड्स डी वन डी टू डी थ्री आर आइडियल एंड द इनपुट्स ई वन ई टू ई थ्री आर जीरो वोल्ट फॉर लॉजिक जीरो एंड टेन वोल्ट फॉर लॉजिक वन वॉट लॉजिक गेट्स डज द सर्क्यूट रिप्रेजेंट्स सो इंफॉर्मेशन रिलेटेड टू लॉजिक गेट्स कैन बी फाउंड इन दिस फॉलोइंग इनपुटल कोर्स बाई प्रोफेसर सांतनु चट्टोपाध्याय डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड इलेक्ट्रिकल कम्युनिकेशन इंजीनियरिंग आई आई टी खरगपुर बिफोर गोइंग टू साल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम फर्स्ट वी विल अंडरस्टैंड हाउ द बेसिक लॉजिक गेट्स कैन बी इंप्लीमेंटेड यूजिंग सिंपल स्विचेस सो एज्यूम वोल्टेज स्विच इज कनेक्टेड लाइक दिस एंड टू सीरीज स्विचेस आर कनेक्टेड लाइक दिस सो हियर आई कनेक्ट सम रेसिस्टेंस आर like this so these switches are with respect to say suppose bit b1 and the input b0 okay so this switch is open when b1 equals to 0 and switch is closed when b1 equals to 1 similarly b0 output i will take here suppose if B1 equals to zero and B0 equals to zero. That means both switches are open. That means this voltage source is not connected to this resistance. Then output V0 is simply zero. Suppose when any one of the switches open, that means either B1 equals to zero or B0 equals to zero. That means one switch is open circuit and other switch is short circuited. even this case also this 10 volt source is not connected to this resistance r because one switch is open so in this case also current passing through this circuit is zero so the output is zero so when both switches are closed that means both are logic one what will happen when both are short circuited means this 10 volt source is directly connected to this resistance r V not is nothing but 10 volts, so I will treat 10 volts as logic one. So this implements end gate. Similarly, if I assume the switches are connected in parallel, so I will take output here. Okay, so say this is switch B1 and this is switch B not. So when B1 is zero and B not is zero, that means both switches are open. That means this is a open circuited. so v0 is simply zero when any one of the switch is closed that means any one of the input is logic one what happens this say suppose if i assume b0 is short circuited okay that means this 10 volts is directly applied to this resistance r so v0 is 10 volts that means here logic one when any one of the switch is closed output will be logic Say suppose if both switches are closed. In this case also, this 10 volts is directly appear across this resistance R. That means V not is 10 volts, so this will be logic one. So this is two table corresponds to R gate. So by using this information, we can solve the above problem. In the problem statement, they mention diode is idle. That means if this node voltage at the p terminal is greater than v2 then the diode is on say suppose if v1 is less than v2 diode is off so when diode is on it acts like a short circuit simple short circuit when a diode is off that means it acts like a open circuit switch so when v1 is less than v2 that means it acts like a open switch when v1 is greater than v2 the diode is on it acts like a on switch okay so coming to this problem assume when all inputs are at logic zero then what happens here at the p side some positive voltage is applied that means all the diodes are on E1, E2, E3, 
and output V0. Okay. So, when E1, E2, E3 all are zeros, what happens? All the diodes are on. When all the diodes are on, that means I can draw the circuits like this, okay, a short circuit. So, all these terminals are connected to 0 volts, that means ground. So, V naught is equals to 0. So, output is logic 0. Uh, suppose, if any one of this input is logic 0, what happens? Say, suppose if E 1 is 0, irrespective of this thing, say, suppose if E 1 equals to 0, this is short circuited. So, and these are open circuited and this is also open circuited. So, any one of this input is 0. So, there is a short circuit connected from V naught to logic 0 volts. So, output V naught is 0. That means, in the, all these cases, the output will be 0. When, when all the inputs are at logic 1, so then what happens? when all are ones, that means, so here 10 volts is applying, that means at the n side the voltage is higher than the p side, that means all the diodes are off. So, here resistance R is there, here some 10 volts is applied and this is your V naught. So, here 0 volts, 0 volts, 0 volts. Here what happens? When, when is all the switches are open, what happens? There is no current through this resistance R. So, this 10 volts appear across this node V naught. That means, this is logic 1. So, this corresponds to a 3 input AND gate. So, option C is right answer.